What's up, my dudes? Valk here. And today, really not good news. So, basically, to catch you guys up on what happened with the Dragon Ball situation, from what I understand, I could be wrong, but this is what I get that happened. It took me a lot of digging to find out, and I basically found out this. Uh, there were games in the um, uh, games on Roblox that had Dragon Ball in the name. It was Dragon Ball Final Stand and one other Dragon Ball game. And basically, they got DMCA'd and their name was forced to change. However, they were basically able to stay up. You know, once they fixed the name and complied, they were basically able to stay up fully functioning how they are. So, it just in uh, just to be safe, a lot of anime Roblox games are starting to now uh, put out copyright models for Dragon Ball units. So we have some very funny units to go over today in AWTD. Um, I think it's a little, personally, this is how I think of it, I think it's a little bit of an overreaction, because I don't think DMCA is too bad. Because, like like I said, let's say you get dmca your game goes down for one or two days, you fix the DMCA, you comply to it, and then your game's back up and running. So, may, I could be wrong, but that seems to be the process from an outsider looking in. Could absolutely be wrong on it. Hey, look, Peem's on the Soul Banner, nice. But, I do want to go over the units today and show you guys what they did with all the Dragon Ball units. And, it's pretty damn funny. I did already look at them. So this is going to be very entertaining to look at, to say the least. So let's go to Veshikun. You can already see uh, Vegito already has some really funny outfits. Uh, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare Delete Kun None, and then Reindeer. Uh, he has some really funny outfits, and I have most of the skins, so we are going to be able to look at a lot of these. So yeah, uh, here we have Vegito. You guys can see what's going on here. His hair hasn't loaded in yet, but you can see what's going on. It's pretty funny. Next up is Dimensional Hitman. This is Hit. Uh, yeah. So, not only is Hit an awful unit, but now he looks like this. But luckily, this skin still looks really dope, so just use the King Crimson skin if you got the BP. I highly recommend that. Next up is Evil Kai Zamasu. Uh, Zamasu, he, yeah, he looks like this now. That's a thing. Yeah. Yeah. Next up is a Super Saiyan God Goku. Um, he is Aang. Av he's Avatar Aang. Yeah. Yeah, just straight up the Avatar. Next up is Frieza. Yeah. Um, yeah, Frieza looks like this now. <laughs> Next up is um, Goku Black. And yeah, you guys can see what happened there. Oh, I guess I lose the skin now. I guess that's kind of bugged. Yeah, this is, yeah, yeah, uh-huh. This is done in a hurry, so of course there's a lot of bugs involving it. But yeah, it's, it's pretty entertaining. Uh, Gohan, yeah, he looks rough. Like Gohan, I'm going to be real, Gohan looks awful compared to the rest. Gohan looks really bad. Vegeta, funnily enough, none of the Vegetas seem to have changed. Uh, Majin Vegeta still looks fine. All the Vegeta seem good, which is base because Goat Vegeta. So here we have all of these. You guys can see this. Pretty dope. Uh, Majin Vegeta. He still looks like Majin Vegeta. He has the Creeper skin, but I'm, for now I'm going to keep him Majin Vegeta till he gets changed. Pretty sure he will eventually. Uh, but he still looks really dope. Uh, and then we have Bulma got changed completely to this. To interesting. Next up, we have Broly. Got changed into Uvagen, basically. He just looks like Uvagen now. Less hairy Uvagen. Uh, I don't know what the idea was with Broly, but that, that's entertaining. Coolin. The Krillin's still the same. Uh, this Goku, actually, because Prowler Goku is here, this Goku actually is still the same. Here you have Ginyu, who got changed. Uh, but Xeno Goku's the same, and then Prowler Goku is the same. So yeah, that's 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 pretty funny. Uh, King Piccolo, base still the same. Here you have Kid Goku, who is now literally just Aang. They just turned Goku into Aang. Now all these are finally loaded in. And then you have Vegeta here, who yeah, Vegeta looks pretty dope. Um, still just Vegeta. So like I said, this basically stems from um. This stems from some Dragon Ball games that were using the name. Their name was like Dragon Ball Final Fate was one of them. I don't remember what the other one was. Because the only thing I could find was a YouTube video covering this. Uh, but it was Dragon Ball Final Fates. And there was another Dragon Ball game. 
and their names got changed because they got DMCA'd by Toei themselves because they were basically labeling themselves as official product. So I do think that these tower defense games going and changing all their models entirely to copyright free models is a little bit of an overreaction, but then again, I'm not as well informed of the situation as they are. I could be completely wrong and feel free to correct me in the comment section below, but that's all I could find. I asked around, I literally asked so much. I asked around, I tried to figure out what was going on. I'm like, why are they doing this to my beloved Dragon Ball? Like, what is going on, right? So I tried to figure out what's going on and the only thing I could find, even asking in different discords, asking everybody I knew, the only thing I could find was that Toei copyrighted two games because they had Dragon Ball in the name, which means they were, dra they were licensing themselves as official product, even though they weren't. So it makes sense that they get copyrighted. If you're going to make an anime game on Roblox, you should not use the name of the anime and label yourself as an official game of that, basically. So yeah, that's basically where it's at with all of that. Now, a lot of people are curious because I do know a lot of you guys know I was waiting on a Dragon Ball update to basically see if I want to get back into the game because I really like Dragon Ball. Well, now Dragon Ball is kind of uncertain. Don't know what's going to happen in Dragon Ball. All I know is the units were basically done and they were just going to be tacked on to Anniversary or pushed back beyond Anniversary or whatever. So I guess now I'm just waiting on Anniversary and seeing because they're hyping up Anniversary to the moon. So if Anniversary is good, then yeah, I'll probably keep playing, but we'll see. We'll see what they do. But yeah, I just wanted to showcase that for you guys. Show you guys uh, what all they did. Also, if you guys feel like playing AWTD right now, there's two times Zeno rates, which uh, Zeno John used to be really, really good. He's not as good anymore because he got power crept to the moon because they dropped some absolutely wild units between the Explome Mage and Taruki. Uh, John's not as good as he used to be, but uh, he's still a pretty cool unit to have because he's so rare. Anyways, thank you guys for watching as always. Let me know what you guys think about the copyright stuff in the comment section below. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace.